Hello and welcome to all our viewers. I am Sanket Shikhar and I am back again this week in yet another episode of AI Weekly Gossip. And today I will talk about Andhra Pradesh to introduce AI based system for pensioners. The Andhra Pradesh government has announced the introduction of an artificial intelligence based real time beneficiary identification system by October 2020. The RBIS will replace the old pension distribution system, which is currently in place for pensioners' identification. The move is to curb the scope of misappropriation of funds that is present in the current PDO system with defects. The move comes as a part of nine promises made by the YSRCP during the election under which the government pays pensions to over 51 lakh people from poor and vulnerable groups such as senior citizens, widows, single women, persons with disability, and several other such citizens. The social security pensions, however, are not uniform for all the group. It ranges from Rs. 2250 per month for groups such as senior citizens, widows, toddy tappers, weavers, single women, fishermen, ART personnel, traditional cobblers, while the disabled person, transgender, DAPU artist, it's 3,000 per month. People with chronic kidney disease are paid 10,000 per month. As most of the beneficiaries are uneducated, the PDU authentication through thumb impression is found to have given rise to corruption. The pensions are dispersed by village and ward secretariat volunteers after receiving thumb impression. Due to several reasons such as improper thumb impression or no impression at all, the volunteers are reported to do a partial payment keeping the other half for themselves. This practice will be curbed with the introduction of AI-based RBIS which is all set to be introduced in October. The system will allow people to authenticate by facial recognition on real-time basis as shared by the official. The system has been already deployed in East and West Godavaris and Krishnan district for the last three months as a part of an experiment. Only after the successful implementation of the system has the officials now decided to roll out the technology statewide, revealed the officials. Well, this is all for this week. I will meet you again next week with a new topic on artificial intelligence. Till then, stay safe and do not forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon.